When you fight corruption, corruption will fight you back. My name is Muhipa Dankaka, popularly known as Farida. My business name in Nigeria is Farida Business Ventures. I produce rice, I distribute for the past 35 years. I didn't come to this place to make money or to serve my father's land. I have 37 commissioners. Objectives and some of them, what brought them here is quite different. What they are looking for is quite different. And I swear with Almighty God, apart from the oath, I can take the Holy, I can, okay, I can take Quran. They gave me a Quran, that's what I swore with. Before I came here, I've made my name. I've made my money. I didn't come here, I'm sorry, with all, please, with all respect to everybody. God forbid. God forbid. Let me tell you a small story. Some of them, not all of them, they have reasons why they are attacking me. And they, I'll still they mention your people. name, so mention their name. I win, one after the other. When I first came in, most of them are my party close people around here. Hack them. Or she's always in my office. All of them, they are always in my office. But what they wanted me to do, I told them I cannot do it. I don't, I'm a very quiet person. And I keep certain secrets as a secretary chairman. Even if I'm not here, I have to just swallow certain things and leave everything in the hands of God. Before I came to this place, they were selling slots. The place is like a market. And you can find out for people that live in Abuja if I'm lying. When I came in, I met with all the commissioners. And I told them that they gave us a Quran. I don't want anything that would destroy me or my family. And they can bear witness, all of them here, we're under our hearts. Some of them here, like uh, Oshu, he bought a property. And told the person that holds the property that you'll be paying with slots. I stop it. I have it. They took it to court. It's right inside. I'll bring them because I did not know that we, they have planned this thing. I should have come with documents. Order, 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 order. I stopped Lagos from going around because they went by going around from one place to another with some fake commissioners, his friends. And I have people that they've gone to. I will not mention the names, but when you call me, I will call them. I send letters to Lagos, to all the commission, to all the MDS in Lagos. If you do not see my signature, do not honor it. And the same thing for Rivers. I sent a letter to Rivers. If you don't see my signature, do not honor it. I'm so surprised. But I will come back to that. I have 37 commissioners. If you look at, I wish all of us are here. All those people that are former governor, former deputy governor, former minister, they are not, most of them are not here. Professors and so on. If they are here, they will testify to it. They are all by my side. Yes, I have 30. And they have seven. And I stood my grant that period. I'm not saying it's all of you, but they instigated others to join them because I refused. I refused it because of the Quran, and I refused it because of, what am I looking for in this world again? What am I looking for? My children that are all grown up. I've made, I don't even have houses, I have houses everywhere before I joined this place. I have my business. So what am I looking for? I told them, and some of them, they joined me. They now call themselves integrity side. The, the, whatever you are going to that is going around, they are the one. Social media that is going around the whole Nigeria, they are the one. But I refuse to say it. I want to ask, before you get appointment in this Nigeria, you must have checked everything you have. I didn't 
finished school in abroad, I school in Nigeria. I have my classmates everywhere. I went to Airbnb in UK. In UK, I was the only lady in the class of 40. I was the only lady in the class. As I'm talking now, my classmates can start writing you. During my MBA level, I have classmates everywhere. No, 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 no. please. I have to explain. It's my personality that I'm talking Please, members, now. Speak please. Now. Uh, 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 I'm coming. Sorry. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Let's speak to record. Let's record, sir. Let's speak to record. You allow someone to talk too much. I'm coming. Members. The secretary handed over 24 committees to me. He said, I don't know you from any items I'm meeting. And because we are 37, I want everybody to be active. I change everything to 37. Here you see it. This is Abia. This is Adamawa. This is Akwa Ibom. We have 37 of them. Everybody, they have their committee, committee chairman. And we now put each one of them, they have one one per zone. As a member, what our act says, when anybody, either the executive, maybe the DG or the MG, when they call me, they will see me first. And we, together with whoever is the chairman, we welcome them in. They will go and interact with them. Sir, like Ginica, it was when you got there that you went, you had only secondary school, that you went back to school. They are not always around. I'm coming, yes, they are not always around. Will I now ask an MBA to wait for them? Maybe it's about a week they come back. I have queries I gave to some of them. And I'll bring them. I gave queries to all of, most of them. They don't come. And when I look at it, that it's about four or five days. What will I do? I ask another person to take over. I hope you will ask those that we asked them ah, to we come. That they didn't come for come. someone to take we over. We are going to call us back. Everybody will still come back. 37 of us. 36. So what, 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 what will I do? Will I act and just wait? wait. <laughs> and let me tell you something. I swear with Almighty God. Uh, you have sworn already. I'm coming with the hope that is on me. Yes. Are we gone? Most of them ever. is their personal interest. I am the one what talking to her. For. She has sworn already. And, uh, yes. And I want, to, I want to go further. Because uh, later I'll ask the secretary to say one, one or two things. Wait now, let her exhaust her reply. Let her exhaust her. Chairman. I, 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 hope, I, I want to, I have, I have, excuse me, me excuse me, they talk about DSS. Uh -huh, yes. Because this is where I want to bring your attention. Speak one to the some, issues, One of them wanted to life. have the list of the, of the DSS, NFIU, NDLEA, and some other ones that are sensitive. And I told them, if you bring out this list out for the NDA, they can go and wipe out their family. I refuse them. Yes, there are some MDAs that are sensitive that are with me. But what I did, I constituted about 10 of the, of the elders that are the one in charge. Mr. Chairman. Dear Mr. Chairman, let me explain myself down. Let me explain. So what are we talking about in the DSS? Chairman, chairman. If people excuse me. When they chairman, federal the character. Sir. Chairman, federal character. Yes, sir. Each and every member of the committee, you are protected. Yes, thank you. By very much. spirit of justice. I, but in justice, I'm coming. Yeah. But if at every member of the committee have right at their point. Yeah. To Prince sort Jack. clarification no from what you say. We see, we are still going to. Honorable oh, Wale, okay. I have yes, something sir. to say. Okay. May you pause and. Okay. Small. Thank you to protect you. Uh, I was the person who said you deserve to have access to all the records brought in on allegations made against you, so that you can rightfully, you know, defend, speak to those uh, allegations. Uh, allegations. In your statement you just made, and because I don't want to forget that um, there were recruitment by NFIU, let me put it security, sec no, security agencies, NFIU, EFCC, and all that. But I want to ask if a commissioner in a Federal Character Commission who was.
was uh, appointed by Mr. President, confirmed by the Senate, and took oath. Do you, is there any reason why such a commissioner should not have, I'm coming man, should not have access? Is there any reason somebody who has sworn an oath to be a custodian of secrets, of government secrets, is there any reason why such a person shouldn't have access to such records? Thank you. Thank you very much. If it's a joke, exactly. If you have anything to ask from that particular one, you have somebody from your zone. And not to come and meet the executive chairman, somebody has offended you. Yes, but I will not come to that. Now, the issue of the house is because I'm still going to collect documents. I sent a letter when I received that some people, they are the ones that did it. They employ 24. And they've been there for since, since, um, since, uh, what's it called? Since 2021. I sent letters to IPPIS more than four times. I have the letters. They did not remove them. I met a contact general just about two weeks ago about this thing. And I sent letter to IP to uh, DSS and ICPC to so look into it. Who is collecting what? Who is collecting what? And I set, I set up disciplinary committee headed by Kano. At least you are highlighting, but again, in but your submission, back of the, the evidences we of those letters down. that you have sent to IPPS asking for their removal. We have everything here. Thank you. God Almighty will not allow me to start selling slots. I've passed that life in life. But it's okay. Uh, and the issue of the, the, the talk that the EFCC, the EFCC man wanted to Members, employ. We have the time to interact to with them. Sir? Let's listen. The EFCC yes. wanted to employ. Go ahead, go ahead. EFCC wanted to employ. They sent, he said the, 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 yeah, he got the approval from the former Mr. President. And when I look at the amount, I told them, I can, the number, I told them I cannot do it. Even the four calls came in that these people, we should go ahead and allow it to happen. And I sent for him, he came down. And I called the commissioners, am I right or wrong? I called more than 50 commissioners. They sat down, they sat down with him. And it, 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 they asked questions and so on. At the end of the day, he brought his nominal road down. He explained everything to us. And we asked him to split it. We cannot give the 900. He brought 300 for the first time, which he employed him. And their junior staff, staff catchment area. There are most of them that do not stop. So I, and even the man, the day he came, he met all of us. Because I called almost per zone. I called 222 per zone. Then about three, four other people. They met us there. So what is my own? I will just put it that whatever you do, if you tell lies to destroy another person, remember that. That you will follow you later in life. Find out about that, madam. Yes, excuse me. Excuse me, sir. I'm sorry, sir. And you are in a government session, parliament to the executive, having carrying out an investigative uh, motion. Please, your duty is to speak to the issues. You don't have any right to swear anybody. Your duty is to speak directly to the issues canvassed. And let me go a step further to inform you. If you have all these issues as to Mr. President's approval, waivers given, numbers asked for, you replied, you acted, these are the documents this secretariat asks you to present to this committee. And you have not so done, you have not done that. Please, please, can you listen to me? Please, can you listen? Your duty is to whether President gave an approval. All the approvals Mr. President gave must be submitted to this committee. Parliament has scrutinized presidential approvals and have seen it, have given a number of interpretations. So we are not cowed by President's approval. We want to see the President's approval. So every document, assuming that you 
have all these documents you are referring to. I don't think that you replying them. Reply them with this document to this committee. And the committee will do justice. Let me also advise you that these allegations is not the tipping point of this investigation. Racketeer. When we finish with that, then we will have cause to deal with this other issue that may have de bedeviled the racketeering, the racketeering that had the need for this investigation to be carried out. As was moved in the floor of the chambers by our colleague, right honorable Wale Okina. So please, I advise you, and don't speak in anger because you will be giving more. More, more evidences against yourself rather than responding to the allegations. That's my final advice. Thank you. I think the last point there, I'm going to prepare you for you. Yes, you are a sound guy in the chairman of the Federal Guide Commission. Don't speak in anger. So we should, we should be. Uh, Thank you, chairman. I will say tomorrow. I will use the guy. The chairman. So emotional emotion at the moment. Anybody that talks, I will not ask him to say. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Chairman, thank you very much. My name is Engineer Mohamed Buba Jajere, FICA uh, Fune Federal Constituency of the State. I hereby second the motion moved by my able colleague here. I so second. Thank you. Those in favor that the allegation made against the chairman of the Federal Character Commission and the Commission, she should be given a time based on the right to fear hearing. And the document be handed over to her to enable her to respond to this committee and appear back before the committee on Monday with 36 commissioners of the Federation. She said aye. Aye. And those against, she said nay. Guys, but on a lighter note, the secretary went to the commission want to say something. Before, before, before he said, before you go. Okay, I'm coming. Uh, members have made comments regarding to the central attraction of this investigation. And federal character is very strategic. To us interacting with other MPs, although you are giving us every reason to believe that we should equally investigate you like we are investigating other MPs, which we are going to do that. We must do that. We must investigate the director in Assam, in agency of government, because uh, you have accused yourself of victim of employment arbitrary with evidences and facts. So please, based on the document, we are ruling on accusation against you. That's too late what we are doing here. Now the main issue, with regard to the document we want you to submit about MPs, our brain works here. You have said you are written to MPs to give you waivers. You made mention of that. Yes. I'm sorry, ma'am. You made mention of that. Yeah, the it's, it's, it's equally confusing Not that I'm coming back, that an institution, whether you like it or not, this committee is fair to the two parties. At the end of the day, we will do the right thing based on the facts submitted to us. If you bring back to defend yourself, fine. If you don't bring, so be it. Now on this issue, it's, it's confused the members of this committee. I'm coming back. Even the record you gave us regarding to the time you took over from 2020 is not up to date. So, do you want us to believe the federal character is serious? That a document that emanates from you to agencies, you are now writing to agencies to give you back those documents? Does that make sense, ma'am? Can you explain how? We came, we came in 2020. This is 